Piggy build mode has been out for a couple of days, and today we're checking out someone else's amazing piggy custom level. Hello, everybody. I am Kindly Kian, and welcome back to Roblox. Piggy. As you guys probably already know, the new build mode has been out for a few days, and I've been contacted by several map creators, one of which is a name that you may recognize. His name is Johnster Space Program, and he actually makes Baldi's Basics mods, and we've played many of his Baldi's Basics mods, but he invited me to his custom level, which as you can see, if I zoom out here, oh my gosh, look at that. That right there is Baldi's Schoolhouse, but in Piggy. I cannot wait to check this out. So Johnster Space is gonna give us a grand tour and we might even be able to play a game or two. So let's do it. And of course, huge credit to Johnster Space for making this. Uh, he has a YouTube channel, you can check it out. Johnster Space Program, I'll have a link in the description down below. But here we go, we're loading into the level. As you can see, we start out right here. Here we are at the front of the school. We got our first classroom. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cool. Oh, the orange key. Okay, so he got the yellow key from the first classroom. And that opens up the doorway to the hallway, typically where Baldi shows up. And then what is this? Oh, a crossbow? Okay. Yeah, yeah. can I? Okay, I, I picked up a crossbow, so I guess I got to find a carrot to use for ammo. Where did Johnster go, though? Where, where did he go? Okay, I'm going to follow him. He, he, I mean, he's going to know this map better than anybody else, right? Oh, my goodness. Okay, Piggy is awake now. As you can see, okay, so that's the room going into, like, the faculty room. That's, like, where you can get, like, a candy bar and stuff. Oh, my gosh, this is so cool. <laughs> he's done such a good job. Oh, I love it, a laser door. That's another faculty room, isn't it? All right, so he just opened uh, this door here. Okay. Oh, it's Piggy. I see her. There she is. It's very strange having Piggy chase you through the hallways of Baldi's schoolhouse. I just, there's something unsettling about it. Oh, oh, a carrot. Okay. So this will give me ammo for the crossbow. And then also we got a gold key here, but first I'm going to blast Piggy. Oh, he got Piggy before I did. Okay. Well, thanks for your help. Where is she? Oh, there, she's stunned right there. Oh, so this is our end goal. Okay, so this is the cafeteria. That makes sense. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm actually gonna wait for her to wake up and then I'm gonna blast her. Piggy, are you okay? Okay, you, you fell into the ground for a second there, but I'd knock you out. Okay, I have no idea where Johnster went, but that's okay. I'm gonna grab this gold key, he may have already used this, actually. I, I don't know. Oh, there's Piggy. <laughs> She's down the hallway. She's coming for me. Oh, I hope this doesn't lead to a dead end. Oh, he has the green key. Oh, no. The green key goes into the principal's room or, like, detention room. So we got to get that open. But Piggy is right behind me. That is not good. Okay, so he opened this room. And uh, I think he grabbed a key. What's he holding? Okay, so he has the teal key, which opened up this area, right? Okay, yeah, there you go. Okay, so what's inside of here? The orange key. I, I Okay, I'll grab the orange key. Do I, do I need this? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like he started with the orange key, but maybe it was a different color. Maybe he was actually holding the gold key, and I was walking around with that gold key, and we don't need that anymore. I have no idea where Piggy is. I'm actually kind of freaking out. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Orange key goes here. Of course he knows exactly where everything goes. Oh, hammer. Let's go. Okay, I have the hammer, and then he has the purple key. So I'm going to bust open this. Remove the planks. Yeah, I know the drill. I've played Piggy once or twice. And then let's follow him and uh, see where he uses the purple key. I think it's going to be on one of these doors on this hallway. Remember, there's three doors on this hallway. This is typically a notebook room. What's in here? <gasps> the white key. Did we win? Is that it? That's it? But what about the wrench? There was a laser door. What's the... Oh, I have a feeling Piggy's over there. Is... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there she is. <laughs> that explains why he turned around. 
That definitely explains why he turned around. I want to explore more of the school before we end it, though. This is so stinking cool. Okay, what is that? Oh, they get, that's the gun. Which is actually where, like, the scissors are normally to, like, protect yourself against playtime. What about in here? We got ammo? Okay. All right. I'm still not sure, though, if we did the wrench thing. I didn't do the wrench thing, but maybe Johnster did. He was working pretty fast. This has got a sweeps room. Oh, there's the wrench. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. And uh, I'll take the white key to the front door. But first, I want to see what's inside of the laser room. What do we got? What do we got? What is in here? It's a carrot. <laughs> it's ammo for the uh, crossbow, which um, is good, but you don't need it to win. Which I guess I should have known because we have all the parts that we need to beat the game or beat the level. And finally defeat Baldi, but not Baldi. It's actually Piggy. One thing that's really cool about this map in Piggy is that there's like so many twists and turns. You know, the whole school is like a maze. So it's very easy to kind of throw Piggy off the scent. Although when she does kind of find you, it is freaky. She could sneak around a corner and get you pretty good. But let's take the key to the ending and let's finish it off. Super, super awesome level. Man, that's impressive. Very, very accurate to the actual Baldi's Basics map, man. But now I feel like I need to try and do it by myself without Johnster helping me because he knows where everything is, but there you go. I've escaped. I'm free from Piggy slash Baldi's crazy schoolhouse and that was amazing. Oh, looks like I'm gonna be Piggy this time. Okay, so he set it up as player mode. So I'm gonna be playing as Piggy Baldi. Oh my goodness, we really need a Piggy Baldi character in Piggy. How do we make that happen? I mean, I'm, I'm mousy, so that's kind of cool. What would be the best Piggy skin for Baldi. What would be the closest pig? Maybe Dino Piggy since like he's he's green? <laughs> I don't know. That might work, but I don't know. Oh man, Johnster is going to absolutely destroy me because he knows where everything is. Oh well. I'm going to try my best. I'll try to use my teleport traps effectively. Although I don't know how helpful they're going to be. Let's teleport, shall we? Where did I even put this? I think I put it on the far hallway. Where the heck am I? Oh yeah, okay, I'm right outside the cafeteria. Well, that's not gonna help me all that much. Very bad teleporter placement. Where did he go? He's so sneaky. You know what I should do the next time I play? I think that I'm gonna do the whole run in first person. Cause that's, that's fair, right? Baldi's Basics is in first person. You gotta play in first person. But where did Johnster go? He's so sneaky. Not here. Also, can we talk about how huge these desks are? What kind of giant children are going to this school? Maybe they're the real monsters and we're just trapped in their world. Okay, I see that he's making a little bit of progress. He opened up the teal key room and I think I heard him just open something, but I don't know where he is. Is he in the principal's room? Oh, he did open the principal's room. Okay. He's sneaking all around and I can't even find him. I've seen him once. I think that's the really cool thing about this map because it is such tight corridors. Oh my gosh, he won. He already finished it. But I was saying, because the hallways are so small and like you're just zipping and zagging, uh, it creates a lot of potential for some moments where you're gonna get kind of terrified. Okay, so here we go. I'm getting my own run against the computer and I am going to play in first person mode, which actually I'm already running into a bit of an issue. I can't really see on top of the desks. That's going to be a problem. That is definitely going to be a problem. Now, he did mention that uh, Piggy spawns where Baldi normally spawns, which would be right down that hallway. So let's uh, let's avoid that. Um, this is really actually quite difficult in first person because I can't see very well. Oh gosh! Oh, I put the I put the key down. I should not have put the key down. That was very dumb. I didn't realize that there was other locks with the same color key. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. I need to get back there and I need to get the golden key. Oh no. This is super hard. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay, Piggy. You gotta, you gotta back off, please. <gasps> A carrot. A carrot will save me. Piggy. Stop being mean to me. Stop. 
Just, just stop being mean, okay? You need it. Back off. Okay, there. Good. Now I can get back and open the doors that I didn't open with the gold key because I wasn't paying attention and that was very dumb. Also, uh, I guess I should refill my ammo since it's here. Now, Johnster is not gonna be doing anything. He's just, he's just observing and probably <laughs> laughing at the dumb mistakes that I've been making. But here we go, we got the gold key. We'll come back for the crossbow, but let's open these doors. I should have done this, I should have known. I gotta tell you, playing in first person, it definitely increases the intensity. All right, let's see what's in Goddess Sweet's room. It's the wrench, isn't it? Yeah, we don't really need the wrench. If we need ammo for our crossbow, we'll come back to that. But right now, we, we really don't need that, and we definitely don't need that. What's in here? <gasps> green key. Okay, I think I remember. The green key, I think, is the principal's office. So let's head back this way. Although, I have no idea where Piggy is. That is a big difference between Piggy and Baldy. Baldy slaps, he makes noise. Piggy, nothing. She's a silent assassin. It's very scary. Piggy, where are you at? She's not here, so that's good. Let's grab the red key and open up this room. And just look around, you know, be aware of your surroundings. Okay, I know where the teal key is. It's the faculty room right over here. It actually helps a ton that I know the Baldi's basics map so well. So as long as I can remember where a particular lock goes. Oh, I gotta open this. Can I open it from this side? Yeah, that works. Okay, good to know. But as long as I know where a particular lock is, I know where it is on the map. Like this one is the classroom that's over by the cell phone. The far upper left corner of the school. I know, I've been there many, many times. Go ahead and open that, all right. We got the hammer. I don't know where the purple lock is though. <gasps> what is she doing? She's just, oh, she's trying to get him on the table. So in a way, he is kind of helping me. I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> I'm not complaining. Where is the purple lock? Do you think it's the first classroom on the long hallway on the other side of the school? I think that might be where it is, but uh, let's just check. Okay, nothing here. I'm gonna close this door because I know Piggy's in there. Let's see if it's in here. Yes, it is. Okay, there you go. And there's the white key. We've done it. Not too shabby, although I will admit that Johnster was probably distracting Piggy for me most of that game. Still. Once I got it figured out, I was feeling pretty confident, although Piggy is right there. I don't like that. Don't. She's kind of broken, isn't she? I think I think when she's in the cafeteria, she kind of breaks. Like cuz she was doing that before Johnster was even in that room. When when I was in there just with her, she was kind of like freaking out. Then I blasted her with a carrot. But there you go. I did it! I gotta say, this map was super, super awesome. I considered doing this myself, but there's no way I would have had the, the time or patience to do all of this. He said it took him about six hours straight to do this whole thing. Just a lot of time. It's a lot. And let's be honest, whatever I created wouldn't have been as good as this. But either way, big thanks to Johnster Space Program for making this and letting me play it. Super awesome. Like I said before, Johnster Space Program has his own YouTube channel and he also makes mods for Baldi's Basics that we've played in the past some really, really cool ones. Like the one where we were in a submarine or we went cave mining. They're very good. But either way, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I, I really kind of want to check out more of these custom piggy maps. So if you have a map that you are very proud of and you've put a lot of time and effort into, contact me on Twitter. That's probably the best way to reach me. I can't promise you that I'm definitely going to play your map, but I at least want to see them and maybe we'll make some future videos showing off some piggy custom levels because these are really, really cool. So you can follow me on Twitter at KindlyKean and you can tag me and let me know that uh, you have a map that you want me to check out. But that's going to do it for this episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.